Here is the life street. here once again. We are here to prophesy the downfall of America, which is our pleasure. Yeah, it is, it is a pleasure. And curse, and curse out these faggots. Look at this scripture. <clears throat> Proverbs 16 and 4. The Lord has made all things for himself. Yea, even the wicked for the day of evil. <clears throat> down, 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 oh, yeah, because yeah, cause people try to say, oh, the Lord didn't create evil. He didn't create the wicked. The Lord is nothing but love. The Lord, the, the Lord has no hate. You know what I mean? It's like, yeah, you see how these faggots talk. Yeah, especially the women. The first thing a woman always say is that Jesus don't hate. God doesn't hate anybody. It's all love. Uh, or, or, the, or they say the Lord didn't create evil. The Lord only created love. Well, read that again, bro. Proverbs 16 and 4. The Lord hath, the Lord hath made all things for himself. Yea, even the wicked for the day of evil. For the day of evil. So the Lord is the one bringing that day of evil. And that day of evil is the day of destruction that's coming here to America. And the wicked is Esau, that's the Edomites. Uh, what you got? Hold that, Mark. I see a 45 and 7. I form the light and create darkness. I make peace and create evil. Yeah. I, the Lord, do all these things. Right, so if you're saying that your God, if you're saying God does not hate, he doesn't create evil, that's not the real God. You worshiping a false God. Because the God of the Bible said he created peace, evil, light, darkness. He made everything. There's nothing that exists the Most High did not make. That's why he's called the Creator. <laughs> I got another scripture to back you up to. Because people are like, oh, that's fucked up. Why, why would God do something like that? I got it. Here we go. I'll call what you got. Some, some put me short. Go ahead. <laughs> Hebrews 13 and 8. Yahweh Shai, the same yesterday and today and forever. So he ain't gonna be a destructive God in one book like the Old Testament and the New Testament. That's what they say. The New Testament, all he's all about love. Well, the scriptures say the, uh, there's no new thing under the sun. It said the word. The scriptures say the word was in John one. It says the word in the beginning was the word. The word always been here. And it said the same thing the whole time. You know what I'm saying? From the book of Genesis to Revelation, it's the same thing. It's the same spirit. That the whole book, like you said, through the whole book is it's balanced. <laughs> you know? But a fool can't understand that, man. Because look, the truth ain't for everybody. Like, not everybody's gonna be able to understand the Bible. Most of these people are dumb as hell. Okay, they these people are hopeless out here. They're fucking retarded. So that's why the Lord said he's only dealing with the elect, just a few people. Here you go, bro. This is uh please last 33 and 13. The corners in 15. As the clay is in the potter's hand to fashion it at his pleasure, so man is in the hand of him that made him to render to them as likeness him best. Good is set against evil and life against death. So is the godly against the sinner and the sinner against the godly. So look upon all the works of the Most High Yahweh. And there are two and two one against another. Oh uh, yeah, that's I mean, yeah, without that, you wouldn't have electricity. You know what I'm saying? You gotta have the positive and the negative. That's what you call balance. The most high is all, people always want to say that we're all about hate. We preach nothing but hate. Oh, we, we teach about good stuff too, okay? Y'all, y'all, but people only concentrate on the hate. Yep. You know, all the book, even the hate is good for us. It's good news for us. Hey, actually, it is. Cause the hate, that it is. You're right. The hate, cause yeah, right. Cause their destruction, the wicked, the destruction of the wicked, and that, that right. That's good news for us. Yeah. That's what. That's what we call the gospel. Yeah. Cause you reading the book, 
I mean, the Bible tells you when the Lord comes back, he's destroying the wicked. Yeah, but he loves everybody. Yeah. He said he's going to, well, he said he's going to tread the wine press. Mm. What do you think it means to tread the wine press? Mm. That, mean, that means you stomping on people's heads like a grape. Yeah. Like you say, I'm going to crush your grape. That's one of them dark parables. Yeah, the, the dark sayings that they don't yeah, when you crush someone's grape, they go back to trading the wine press. To make wine, you gotta step on grapes. Like that blood splatter. Yeah, because they got a big uh, a tub. They'll fill it up with billions of grapes. And you just get up in there and just stomp them, get all the juice out. Stomp them for hours. So, yeah, we're gonna be. So, when the time comes, we're gonna be stomping on heathens and two thirds of heads and brains. And we're gonna be squishing their heads. And their brains is gonna be just exploding like a goddamn watermelon. That sounds like good news. Yeah, you ever watched the, uh, the Gallagher? The dude who used to crush the watermelons with the, the hammer? Oh, yeah, yeah. That's how we're going to be doing, people. They showed the, they showed they, the clip uh, of the, the black person. <laughs> yeah, the black Gallagher. <laughs> he started shooting like, ow! He shot somebody in the crowd. <laughs> that shit was funny as hell. Here you go. This is on Proverbs 16 and 4. The Lord hath made all things for himself. Yea! Even the wicked for the day of evil. That's a good Self-explanatory. I got one to back it up. It's that evil that the Lord that he made for, these, for, the, for the wicked, he's gonna come and squash two thirds. Damn, look. Let me just find that something. But that's part of the reward. That's part of the reward that's coming yep. with the Lord. Hey, get that on camera, right? Get that good. Yeah, you know that's part of that reward. You know what I'm saying? We're we gonna be snatching these hoes up. We're gonna be raping them. That's part of the spoil. We're going to be snatching them up. You know, the Lord's going to give us all kind of women. And it's going to go back to the, to the, to the old way of life. The, the, right, the proper way. Women are not going to be an authority. There ain't going to be no women leaders. All right? The women ain't going to be in charge of nothing. <laughs> except for the household and their business. You know what I mean? Whose children she have, well, the righteous man she lay down have children, man. Yeah. She's gonna take on righteous order for that man. She gonna have that fear of the Lord in her too. To know, to know better to go on. She's not even gonna think of who's gonna head. Yeah, and slavery's coming back too. So we're gonna have slaves too. Cause that's real money, cause right now the money we got, they give, they give you federal reserve notes and they call that money. That's not money. Look, real money is gold and silver. Real money is, real money is women, wine, grain, uh, you know what I mean? Commodities, fuel, gasoline, cattle. That, yeah, cattle. That's money. Not no goddamn paper. A little picture on it. said a transvestite killed three people and, and then it tried to blame the murders on its former male self. Wow. And they'll probably get off too. They'll probably say, yeah, it was your old self that did it. It wasn't right, you. Right. He's not confident to stand trial. He's not confident to stand trial so they'll send him to an institution to get medicine. And yeah. His family can come see him as they well. They're rehabilitate him. Right, right, right. Right, that's an it's Edomite right. that does that. Gotta give those special rights. But a nigga, you know a nigga's, a nigga, you about to hang it up, motherfucker. You know what I mean? You better go on the run, because they're going to catch your ass, they're going to burn your ass. Especially that steak got the motherfucking, uh, 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 what's it called when they put you to death? Death penalty? Yeah, the death penalty. Ain't no motherfucking Edomite can be sitting in the field, no fucking death to jail, getting some goddamn injections, man. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah, I never, I never seen that. Yeah, they offensive, man. Yeah, I people are offensive people. Yeah. I've never seen that either. Yeah. Offensive ass people, man. 
I ain't never, I'm trying to think when I ever see a man from another nation get, get the electric chair, man. I don't never ever see one. Yeah, I never, yeah, well, I never. first see that woman they executed two months ago in Texas? I, I that was a Jake. Y'all ain't see her? Yeah, all of them did. All of them seem like that's hey, what I'm saying. But that bitch look good. But, Ooh, still look good. But according to the Bible, we're supposed to be having all kind of executions. According to the Bible, the majority of people should be executed. Sure. Because the scriptures say, first of all, faggots got to get put to death. But it's legal to be a faggot. <laughs> you, you, can, you can get married. Two faggots can go get married. Uh, you know what I'm saying? It's legal to commit adultery. You know what I'm saying? They encourage adultery. All these women didn't have had sex with like a thousand men. But lock you up for having two daughters. Dude, it's so funny. And yeah, right. Or then they got the nerve to put somebody to death. They got the nerve to put somebody on death row. When they ass is uh, guilty of death and damn stuff. We all these wicked ass judges convicted people to death. They evil as hell, man. Churches out here have any kind of truth, man. They're all a bunch of faggots. Every last church you go to, I don't care what church you tell me to go to, if I go up in there, you're gonna be a bunch of weak bitches up in there, man. They just look like faggots. Winona Ryder. Oh, yeah, Winona Ryder. Uh, Beetlejuice? Yeah. How about sexy? I like Winona Ryder. Yeah, she looks pretty hot. Yeah. This is good. Beetlejuice. Yeah, see, I, I like them weird bitches, man. It's all weird looking. She all, yeah, she all mysterious looking. <laughs> it's probably, like that type too. She probably a witch, you know what I mean? Well, actually, all these bitches are witches. Psalms 43 and 1. Judge me, O, most, o power, and plead my cause against an ungodly nation. So America's an ungodly nation. There's no doubt about that. Because, I mean, the first, it, they wrote it in the Constitution. First Amendment says you got the freedom of religion. You can believe whatever you want. You can worship the devil. You can worship Satan. The church, the church of Satan was founded in San Francisco, in America, the good old USA. That gave birth to the church of Satan. Do, do you know the church of Satan was founded in America? Because America is a, a country of devil worshipers, a country of faggots, a country of fucking adulterers. Mm. 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 Look at all these fucking foul spirits out here, man. We're surrounded by wolves. We got that cloak on, though. <laughs> it's really like, actually, yeah, when you really look at it, we're like lions and they're sheep. Uh, we're really rip, rip, ripping the pee. There's a scripture that says that. Yeah, we're going to be lions, bro. Yeah, well, yeah, not yet. We ain't lying yet. Right about that. We're, we're sheep in the midst of wolves right now. Right now, yeah, soon, yeah. Sheep in the midst of wolves. But soon we're going to tear them to pieces. Yep. And he, like the scriptures say, the heathens are going to get broke to pieces, man. Yeah, you got more here? Yeah, or deliver me from the deceitful and unjust man. For thou art the power of my strength. Why dost thou cast me off? Why go I a mourning because of the oppression of the enemy? Oh, send out thy light. That was a good one. That was a good one. I'll read it. That was a good one. I don't know, America's about to be destroyed. God's about to destroy America. You know that? People look at us like we're stupid or something. No, <laughs> they, they see what's happening. They oh, see yeah. America's getting fucked up. Well, you know, they, they, they look at their pride is, is that, sinking. It's that dumbass stare they do, you know what I mean? That dumbass stare. Yeah. yeah, I know exactly what you're talking about. Praise the Lord! <laughs> yeah, yeah she was really concerned about the Lord. She looked like she was ready to uh, suck a cock. Black You can just see in that spirit that she's just out of control. You know what I'm saying? Wow. She's just wilding out. Yeah, she's just wilding out. Praise the Lord. 
That's what I'm saying, man. People really don't want the Lord's kingdom to come, man. But this place got to go for that. No, they, they're in love with Satan. They, they can't give up being a, being wicked. Yeah, there's too much to lose. There's too much to lose. They got too much investment. Yeah. Oh, send out thy light and thy truth. Let oh, send out, hey, we sending out the truth by coming out here teaching. You going? Let them lead me. Let them bring me unto the thy holy hill. Hey, read that uh, scripture number, please. This is prop. This is Psalms forty-three and three. Want to read again? Yeah, read that again. For Psalms forty-three and three. Oh, send out thy light and thy truth. Let them lead me. Let them bring me unto thy holy hill and to thy tabernacle. Yeah, that's what we're doing right now. We bring everybody to the holy hill of Zion. This is Zion right here. This is Jerusalem. That's what this is. Well, like right here where we're at. The rest of this is motherfucking the toilet, the sewers. The commode. <laughs> yeah, the commode, the outhouse. Oh, wow. Yeah. Some kind of motherfucking yeah, monk. Then will I go unto the altar of the Most High, unto the, unto Yahweh, my exceeding joy. Yea, upon the harp will I praise thee, O, o Yahweh, my God. Yeah, so, right. Uh, who's that, David? Yeah, because David, he can play the harp, he can play the guitar, he can play all the instruments, you know what I mean? That, that's one of the attributes to the Israelites, the great musicians. Uh, yeah, when you play music, you're supposed to praise the most high in your music. Like, you ain't supposed to be talking about a bunch of bullshit. You know what I mean? Really, you shouldn't be talking much at all. Because you'll probably fuck it up making a song. Yeah, because when they do give reference to the most high, they talk about Caesar Blanchett, Jezreel Blanchett. Yeah, all you that bullshit-ass gospel music. You know what I mean? You can't listen to that shit. Bro. All that bullshit. All that bullshit. Okay, this is Psalm 50 and 16. I'm gonna start at um. I'm gonna start at 14. Psalms 50 and 14. Offer unto your house of thanksgiving and pay thy vows unto the Most High your house. And call upon me in the day of trouble. I will deliver thee, and thou shalt glorify me. But unto the wicked, the house said, What hast thou to do to declare my statutes? Uh, or, oh, uh, go ahead, keep going. Or That's that true. thou shouldest take my covenant in thy mouth. And yeah, that goes back to them so-called Jews and goddamn rats. You Jew know what? Rats. Yeah, what do you do with a rat, man? You exterminate, you call the exterminator on a rat. Right, you give that motherfucker some poison and let You, you take out the whole nest. You find a nest where mm -hmm. they have you take out the whole goddamn nest. The rape, baby rats and all. You get the baby rats, the mama yeah. rats, the, you know papa what I mean, rat. the papa rats. <laughs> and you just fucking exterminate them. Yep. I'm gonna fuck with some rats around. That's why I love cats, man. Cats hate rats, man. Cats exterminate them motherfuckers, man. And we lions, so we're Oh, yeah, that's true. Yeah, they're rats and we're a cat. Yep, yep. That's a good way to look yep. at they it. Got a, they got a natural born hatred for each other. <laughs> you true. know what I'm saying? Now, these motherfuckers gonna be on the video. Now, these motherfuckers are lions. They call themselves cats now. But they was Israelites. Yeah, <laughs> they come at us. They, they, come, don't, they don't understand spiritual talk. Um, what hast thou to do to declare my statutes, or that thou shouldest take my covenant in thy mouth? Seeing that thou hatest instructions and castest my words behind thee, I mean, they, you're in the court system alone, they got the Bible, you swear in on the Bible. Uh, to, be, be, to become a president, oh. when a president's inaugurated, they, 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 in front of they have to swear in on the Bible. Yeah, they put it, they put it, Hey, I right. got a scripture for that. I don't that. know what they do with their wicked shit, but they, you know. He swears in uh, Obama. I think they actually put their right hand on their heart and I, put I the, their fucking the left hand on that, the Bible. That goes against the Bible. Though. So they're saying they're upholding the Bible, right? That's what right. they're saying. This is like, like, what, 1984, that faggot Ronald Reagan declared the Bible the law of the land. Yeah, he messed wow. law of the land. You know, it was a president that did that shit. They're a great president because they love some Ronald fucking faggot Reagan, man. That's why the motherfucker gave that devil Alzheimer's. Yeah, That's, he That's why he was eating shit. That's why Ronald Reagan was eating his own shit. He was his own shit. You know he was wearing yeah, diapers. Oh, oh, yeah, he was yeah, eating he his was. own shit. Yeah. Oh, damn. I didn't know that. <laughs> yeah, that was the most half for you right there. Because they didn't do that to somebody in the ancient world. Making them fuck. Like, man, I'm thinking it was a chicken or that something. That was Nebuchadnezzar. Yeah. 
Yeah, he was a damn chicken. Yeah, he, tur he turned his ass into a chicken. <laughs> he, he was fucking. Yeah, that's the fear of my side right there. That's the fear of my side. <laughs> so they taking this Bible in their hands as if they uphold the laws of the Bible. So they're declaring themselves in front of the world. You know, it seems right now everybody's calling America hypocrites anyway. Oh, yeah, yeah. Especially yeah. what their foreign policies on how they're dealing with shit, man. Now everybody's starting to call them hypocrites, man. Yeah. With their democracy. Anyway, bro, you got, um, you got something? Oh, uh, yeah, hold on. Okay, let me read this. Oh, yeah, hold on, let me get it. Okay. And I'll read that again real quick. Okay. Um, this is Psalms 50 and 16. But unto the wicked the Most High said, What hast thou to do to declare my statutes? or that thou shouldest take my covenant in thy mouth. Seeing thou hatest instructions and casteth my words behind thee. Oh, that's right. You was talking about how you were how to judge when a president becomes president, he becomes inaugurated. First of all, to become inaugurated means that you're made to auger. The auger, that goes back to the ancient Rome. That's where you get the word uh, Augustus. That's where you get the word August. Because the Augustus the Augustus was the high priest of Rome. Because the Roman Caesar, the emperor, Augustus. he wasn't just the emperor, he was also the high priest. He, he was in charge of the, 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 the chief sacrifices. The, the emperor of Rome would sacrifice, have sacrifices in public. It'd be a giant event. Mm -hmm. All the whole city would come out while he sacrificed a bull or something to Zeus mm -hmm. or to uh, Jupiter. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Yeah, so, yeah. He was the augur, the Augustus. So here it is, the president, when it, when they uh, when a president swears in, they call it the inauguration. You know what I mean? And then he swears in on the Holy Bible, a King James Bible at that. Upon the ancient Roman Christians. All right, so let me read this. And this is what the King James Bible says that they swear on. So it's, and they know this Bible, they study. Okay? What's up, Esau? A bunch of faggots. Uh... I was about to read this. Uh, Matthew 5 and 33. Uh, Again, ye have heard that it hath been said by them of old time, thou, sh thou shalt not forswear thyself, but shalt perform unto the Lord thine oaths. But I say unto you, swear not at all. Neither by heaven, for it is God's throne, nor by the earth, for it is his footstool, neither by Jerusalem, for it is the city of the great king. Neither shalt thou swear by the head, because thou canst not make one hair black or white. But let your communication be yea, yea, or nay, nay, whatsoever more than these cometh evil. <laughs> All right, so if you were supposed to be get put in a high position of power, you ain't supposed to swear in. You just say yes or no. You know what I'm saying? Swearing in, taking an oath. That's how you know the Freemasons are evil. They're wicked and evil. What do they, they go in the secret, have a secret ceremony? You got to have a big ceremony, tie a rope around your neck. You got to take your shirt off and, and put a knife to your heart. You got to get down on your knees. You got to lay down in a coffin underneath a tree. So, so you know that shit ain't right, man. Yeah, that shit ain't right. I wouldn't even play and do that shit. Laying in a coffin. Hey, I wouldn't even play around and do that shit. Put a noose on your neck. So that goes way beyond just swearing. That's going all out doing a whole damn wicked ceremony. Yeah, that's on some other level. That's, that shit is strictly for Esau. Yeah, that shit's all vanity anyway. That, that little ceremony don't mean a goddamn thing. You're just wasting your time doing that dumb shit. Right, because I'm laughing. Right, he's laughing. Yeah, that ceremony don't mean shit, Dang. man. You going through all this bullshit for what? <laughs> Let me get a scripture. Go ahead. <clears throat> Zephaniah 1 and 14. The great day of the Lord is near. It is near and hasteth greatly. Y'all know the great day of the Lord is near? Yeah. And all you homosexuals are going to be destroyed. Y'all know that? You know the great day of the Lord is near? Hey, read that scripture again. Zephaniah 1 and 14. The great day of the Lord is near. It is near and hasteth greatly. Yeah, hasteth, hasteth. Y'all didn't know haste means it, it hurry it. It's coming quick. You know what I'm saying? Y'all, you know the great day of the Lord is coming soon. That's, that's a bad trick, man. Let me do that again. 
Zephaniah 1 and 14, the great day of the Lord is near. It is near and hasteth greatly. Even the voice of the day of the Lord. Yeah, you know the most high, he about to destroy America. Y'all know America's about to be destroyed? Go ahead. <laughs> the mighty man shall cry there bitterly. That day is a day of wrath, a day of trouble and distress. Oh yeah, yeah, the day. Hey, read that again. Hey, the day of the Lord is a day of trouble and distress. Wait, there's a peg too. Hey, all you so-called Jews, you're going right into slavery. Yeah. Round of applause. Good, 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 round of applause. Good, good, good. That's right. Job well done. There's a long to applause too. Hey, the so-called Jews in the state of Israel, hey, they're not the real Jews. According to the Bible, the uh, Hebrew Edomites, they're devil worshippers, faggots, okay? Child molesters, sorcerers, and wizards. Y'all know America's about to be destroyed by God, you know that? Don't think that shit's funny, right? I wish that fucking Jew rat would come over here. He's wearing a little funny little hat. Little titty cap. Yeah, little man. Titty cap. Okay. <laughs> what kind of weirdo shit is that? Who walk around with some weird ass little hat on their head all the time? When the, the New Testament says you ain't even supposed to cover up the top of your head. Titty cap hat. <laughs> That's some stupid looking shit. Yeah. It serves no purpose whatsoever. You just look like a weirdo. That's the only reason they wear it, so they can look fucking weird. You know? Zephaniah 1 and 14, the great day of the Lord is near. It is near and hasteth greatly. Even the voice of the day of the Lord, the mighty man shall cry there bitterly. The day is a day of wrath, a day of trouble, a day, a day of trouble and distress. A day of wasteness and desolation. A day of darkness and gloominess. That's that desolation. That's why America, uh, America's about to go to war with Russia. Who do you think's gonna come out of that? Desolation, destruction, fire. <laughs> it's gonna be, uh, man, you know, no, it's gonna be, I don't know how many people gonna get killed. Millions. Yeah, millions and millions and millions of people. Millions. They's gonna get burnt the fuck up. By the, by the day. Million that millions. day and a million the next day. Well, see, we're gonna destroy this nation in the hours so now. That's gonna be the greatest slaughter ever on the history of the planet Earth, man. Yeah, that ever witnessed. Yep. It's gonna be. Yep. It, it's, here it is. Yeah, they about to go war with Russia. Cause with that, you got that shit popping off with Ukraine. Don't none of these people. They never even heard of Ukraine before. They don't know where that's at. You know. So these people, they have no knowledge. They're just totally retarded. They ain't got a fucking clue what's going on. They, they, they ain't watching the news. And then in the news they do watch is bullshit. They're talking about that goddamn plane that disappeared. You know what I'm saying? Because you know that plane, that probably did, that probably don't even exist. Hey, there probably yeah, was right. no fucking plane. They probably made that story up to distract from the war. Oh, go ahead. A day of clouds and thick darkness. Yeah, that's the clouds. That's the mushroom cloud. Mm. Hey, you know what I'm saying? For them thermonuclear missiles. A day of the trumpet and alarm against defense cities and against the high towers. Oh yeah, defense cities. Oh, like like over there in uh, Israel, where them fake Jews is at, they got something they call the Iron Dome. Is that what they call it? The Iron Dome. That's, that Iron Dome, they couldn't even stop them little ass uh, Palestinian missiles. They had some raggedy ass missiles. They said and that- And missiles they, made it. They said uh, out of the 120, um, only two of them were shot down. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> I mean, you know, America is investing billions of dollars into that, too. Damn. That's pretty much America's dying. Oh, yeah. That's you all they And uh, you know, America's defense system, they already told you. I mean, it's, it's useless. Russia, if Russia, what Russia going to say American system is pretty good? You're right, Russia said American missile defense system is useless. Useless. You know what I mean? <laughs> what, well, I guess. 120, only two guys. Well, they they said they can't make a, 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 a defense system that works. But America's been destroying a lot of their nukes. Mm -hmm. And they said they're filling up missile silos with cement. They purposely destroying this nation, which is good. That's good. That's what's going to happen. That's real good. Well, they got a new TV show 
you see that? I forgot the name of it. They got a new TV show out. It's about Russians, about Russian uh, agents pretending to be Americans living in America. You see that? Oh, wow. No. I got to see it, though. Because they, they yeah. Russia been working against America for damn near 100 years. Probably longer than that. They hate this place, man. They've always hated this place. Actually, they've always hated each other. Right, they always you know? hated each other. Yep. Yep. So, you know, hey. It's coming, man. Because World War II never actually ended. You know what I mean? It's just been on standby. You know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, They've been waiting on to see who's going to make the next <laughs> move. <laughs> they, they've been ready to launch Went them for missiles. Everybody pay for their missiles. <laughs> they've, been, they've been waiting to launch them goddamn missiles for over 50 years. And they're they going to launch them. That's a long they getting tired of waiting. Yeah, they, 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 they tweak it. Like they, they, yeah, right. They, they, they really tweak it. Well, you know... Well, that's military strategy. They waiting to see who can, who got the, the strategic advantage. Of Russia, they're not going to lose. Okay. Here you go, bro. I got something for you. Revelation uh, 11 and uh, 14. The second war was passed. And behold, the third war cometh quickly. So that third, that that's war, war y'all know World War III is about to pop off, right? America's going to be the... America's about to be destroyed. Y'all gonna get burned up. Y'all, all y'all gonna get burnt the fuck up. You know what I'm saying? See the bitch running into the pole? Yeah. It's on the camera. It's shooting. Hopefully. I'd like to see if he would get broke. Who's wearing the dress? I'm the bitch in the dress. Yeah, you can't go wrong with that. <laughs> Zephaniah, Zephaniah 1 and 17. And that will bring distress upon men that they shall walk like blind men. Oh, yeah, because like we said, everybody's zombies out here, man. These people's out of their minds. You know, there's nothing there. It's like the walking dead. Keep going. Because they have sinned against the Lord, and their blood shall be poured out as dust, mm. and their flesh as the dung. Mm. Neither their silver nor their gold shall be able to deliver them oh, in the shit. day of the Lord's wrath. Oh, let me get some of that too. But the whole land shall be devoured by the fire of his jealousy. <laughs> for he shall make even a speedy riddance of all them that dwell in the land. So, speedy? So yeah, so the, if you ain't right with the Most High, the Lord is going to make a speedy riddance of your ass, okay? You ain't right with the Most High, which you're not. A speedy riddance. Speedy riddance, I love like that. A speedy riddance. <laughs> <laughs> speedy riddance. A speedy riddance. That is, yeah, that's, 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 that's immediately. Right? <laughs> yeah, 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 right. It ain't gonna, ain't gonna be nothing to it. He's gonna take your ass out. That is beautiful, man. Now you gotta read that part again. That, that's yeah, I like that. Zephaniah 1 and 18, neither the silver nor the gold shall be able to deliver them in the day of the Lord's wrath. Like all the banking families, that's the, the bankers are the ones who control America. The, the, who, who owns the banks? The motherfucking Jews. They running everything. So they the one. they got all that money, all those riches. When they rob everyone, they, they got their riches through thievery. You know what I mean? They're a bunch of swindlers. Uh, charging everybody usury or interest, which is against the laws of the Bible. What they charge everybody interest. Yeah, but you got a bank account, they charge him interest too. You know America's about to be destroyed. That's what's coming. The fire. You know, fire and brimstone. Y'all, y'all want to talk about fire? Fire and brimstones is missing. That's some fire and brimstone right there. Man. Uh, go ahead, read that. Zephaniah 1 and 18, neither the silver nor the gold shall be able to deliver them in the day of the Lord's wrath. But the whole land shall be devoured by the fire of his jealousy, for he shall make even a speedy riddance of all them that dwell in the land. Yeah, because you know, the average person don't have no silver or gold. They, they, they laugh at you. If you if you talking about well, how come you don't have gold or silver, they'll look at you like you're stupid. Yeah, they got a bucket full of FRNs. Yeah, they got, they, yeah. they got a wallet full of paper. <laughs> but the motherfucking paper is not money, okay? Do, do you know that paper is not money? Did you know that? So y'all believe it is. Y'all accept it. Yeah, he looked retarded. He looked like the retarded Andy Griffin. Uh, is there more to that? No, oh, that, that was the point. Good. That was good. 
Limitations of 421. Oh, you didn't even get that I'm yet. trying to find the scripture. Oh, let me get this scripture, white boy. Uh, this is uh, Haggai 1 and 6. Ye have so much and bring in little. Ye eat, but ye have not enough. Ye drink, but are ye not, but ye are not filled with drink. Ye clothe you, but there is none warm. And he that earneth wages earn of wages to put it into a bag with holes. All right, hey, hey that's some F. He with holes. <laughs> that, that's a, like, I'm that's a, this Paul porn out. That's the Federal Reserve notes. Yeah. Hey, that's how you get a bank account. So, say you have a bank account. Say you got thousands and thousands of uh, <laughs> dollars in your bank. Don't try to take it all out at once. See if they'll let you. They won't even let you take it. Right, 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 right. But even though it's your money, but they won't let you have it. <laughs> right. And plus, you have a bank account full of millions of dollars with the money losing its value. That's what it means. It's falling out that value. It's losing its value. It's losing its value. Interest going up. Right. Cause, yeah, because back in... Uh, Yeah, well, back before like 1964, all the court, all the dimes, nickels, and quarters, they were all made out of 90%. Don't you got that one? You got that dollar bill? Oh, that's an old one. Oh, yeah, that's, that's a silver certificate. certificate. Oh yeah. Well, I don't have it on me, do I? You know that's bad, man. Cause a lot of people. Uh, no, it's in the house. Yeah, a lot of the youth, man. They they don't think that ever. They never seen it, so they never thought it was real, man. Oh yeah. Well, I mean, all the quarters, dimes, and nickels before 1964 are 90% silver. Mm -hmm. You can actually go redeem silver. Yeah, you can melt them motherfuckers down. Yeah, yeah. It's worth more than 25 cents. <laughs> <laughs> you know what right, yeah. If you got them, yeah, and people got them put up, man, in their attics and shit. That, that's why back in the 1940s, you could buy a comic book for 10 cents. The original Captain America comic book cost 10 cents. Okay, 10 fucking cents. You can't buy a goddamn thing with 10 cents now. That, now a comic book costs five to ten dollars. You remember they used to have penny candy? They don't have penny candy. Yeah, 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 candy. Yeah, they don't yeah. have penny candy no more. Uh, I always go to the place called Town Corner, of course, man. They take my kids going up, man. That penny candy turned into nickel candy. I don't know, I think it's like that penny candy yeah. is now. A dumb. penny used to have value. Yeah. Now a penny, a penny is fucking worthless. worthless. Why even have a goddamn penny? You can't do a goddamn thing with a penny. Throw <laughs> it down into something. You can flip heads and tails with it. Yeah, that's, that's about that's it. That's about all you can do with throw it. it in, throw it into it. the uh, little uh, wishing whale. <laughs> yeah, throw it into the wishing whale. That's all you're you going to do with it. Feed the fish. Oh, that's going off wishing whale. Who you wishing to? <laughs> who you make? Yeah, who do they make wishes to at the wishing whale? What the fuck is that all? Satan. Yeah, that sounds Satan. like some Satan. wishes. What? <laughs> well, you know what, genie? You know making wishes? You know the genie? The genie goes back to the gin. Which is, which is demons. That goes back to uh, Arabia. Yeah. All that Arabian shit, the jinn, oh, the yeah, jinn yeah. and the yeah. demons. There's yeah, a, movie, there's a movie actually about yeah, the Look wish, how the crazy wish man. they went over, uh, they went over uh, Gene, that cartoon Gene of the Land. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah, Aladdin too. Aladdin. See, nope. see they, they put that sh uh, shit on your children, they're like, it's cool. Aladdin, oh, that's a good fa family. Them. Everybody wants a cute little genie, a little demon in a bottle. Yeah, a little demon in a bottle. You know what I mean? But they, see, that's how they do it. They, they make uh, worshiping the devil and uh, demons uh, fashionable. Yeah, they make it cute for the children. Yeah, fat, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's why. That's why uh, Harry yeah. Potter is the number one uh, book. It's the most popular book. Uh, you keep the kids play the Yu-Gi-Oh card. Yeah, yeah. Everything's about sorcery and witchcraft. And it's these motherfucking Jews who's pushing that vibration. The Jews are the ones who making the uh, Harry Potter movies. That's right. Bro. You know what I mean? You fucking right, faggots. Because the Jews are number one sorcerer and a uh, wizard. You know what I mean? Yeah. You got yeah. more of that? Yeah, let me, let me finish. Okay. I, I want to read it from the top again. You know, hey. you know guys about to destroy America? You know that's coming? Thus say the Lord. The oh, you think that's funny, huh? I think it's a joke. <laughs> Hey guy, what? Hey guy, one and six. Ye have so much and bring in little. Ye eat, but ye have not enough. Ye drink, 
but ye are not filled with drink. Yeah, that's that's everybody. That's America's uh, uh, liquor store. That's their motto. You know what I mean? That's America's motto, man. They can't never get enough. Just yeah, yeah, society, man. But that's why you got all these fat bitches. That's why you got so look. No other country do they have fat people like America. There's no you. You go. I traveled the world, son. I've seen. I, I went to Japan. Not a single fat person. Okay, I've been to Thailand. I seen not a single fat person, not one. Right, yeah. you got the only fat people in Japan are sumo wrestlers. Okay, and they they, do, they get fat like that on purpose just for the sport. Yeah, so yeah, plus you got right. It's an epidemic of fat bitches. We have an <laughs> epidemic of fat bitches.